Hey guys, what's up, Capricorn? Thanks for watching. Appreciate it. This is going to be a reading for your immediate future, the situation, and the obstacles in your way, and the outcome of that situation. Keep in mind that the energies can go both ways. This could be woo, your energy or the energy of the person that you're dealing with. Wait, Lord. All right. So flip flop it how you need to. Also keep in mind this is a general reading. Take what's yours and leave the rest behind. Oh, there's secrets all over the shit. Is what it's feeling like. Like I said, though, it's a general reading, so, um, or stress, or, there's something, something's going on. Alright, so if this does resonate with you guys today, please make sure to like and subscribe below. Also, if you guys would like to contact me for a personal reading, find that information below as well. Alright, woo, fuck, what is going on with y'all? Alright, let's see. Many times are changing. <laughs> it won't even come up. <laughs> All right, we need a picture for the cat. So what's going on? All right, Capricorn. There's that stress, that worry. That's way too many. But what's in there? All right, media future for Capricorn. Three cards. Cancer energy with the chariot. All right, so whew, it looks like it's changing around. I don't know what the hell that mess was. That was secret slide, stress. It was causing a lot of stress, but hopefully not, especially with the chariot. That's about balance, getting things back on track, moving forward. We do have the hangman and a lot of love at the bottom. Mutual love too, okay? So let's see where this is going. Show me this hangman. Oh, hold on. Numbers are breaking down to a 10, which is about completion, transformation, which further reduces to a 1, which is a new beginning, which we do have here. So hopefully that storm is over, whatever that was. Show me the chariot. Cancer energy, like I said, it's about moving forward here. You could be keeping a lot of things to yourself, but there's a lot of spiritualness behind it as well. Yeah, okay. Somebody is... <sighs> You could be spying. Okay. So, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, energy. But you already know what I'm talking about if this is your reading. You don't trust the situation. You're protecting your heart because it's got broke before. So, you're not just going to nosedive into anything. There could have been a third energy that came in between you guys, a distance. But it's also like you've been, somebody's been emotionally distant here. Because we have the high priestess there, but that queen of pentacles, sorry, queen of swords is not, it's not about intuition. It's like you're being spiritually guided to push forward, but things are changing. That's why the tower is coming. So yeah, see, somebody's wanting to fight for you. There's jealousy around you. There could have been some type of gossip because of jealousy or things like that. And there also could have been a third energy, but you're, you're, it, well, it could be you or it could be them, but somebody is being like very closed off, very guarded, very protective of their heart, not really expressive emotionally here. But we have the tower, so I think that's changing. It's like that tower had a fall so that shit can rebuild. Show me this hangman, please, for Capricorn. This is somebody looking at things from all perspectives. Thinking about working on things. Can't say that you've actually moved yet or this person. You could work with this person. Give me one more card. Hasn't moved yet, though. Contemplating it. Yeah. All right. Wow. Well, that's good. That's a nice turnaround. So, somebody is seeing things from all angles, right? Looking at things, gaining clarity, perspective. They haven't exactly moved yet, but they're thinking about really putting them work towards something balanced here. Um, if there was an energy in the past, and that's what's trying to balance out. It's like trying to work together for that, that problem solving here, to build something stable, something 
like I was saying with this tower, when it falls, it has to rebuild into something stable. So um, that's what it's doing. But with the hangman there, like I said, make sure you're seeing things from all perspectives. And I can't say that that's actually happened yet. But it's at least on the mindset, which is good. Show me this Ace of Cups for Capricorn. That's a new beginning in love. And this world is here. That's that change that I was talking about. Old cycles wrapping up so that new ones can begin. So why the Five of Wands, though? Because that's like somebody kind of competing or maybe angry. Yeah, see? The Ace of Wands and the Knight of Pentacles. So somebody is fighting for something new here. You could have two people trying to, you know, grab your attention and get at you, but um, just if it's something that you want, because there is a new beginning here, overflowing amount of love. If it's something completely new, you know, some guards got to be dropped. If it's something from the past, then it's understood, but there's a new cycle here, and it's like you're fighting for that with the Knight of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Energy, Taking your time, moving slowly, but this is that cycle change. So, um, if it's something brand new that you want, it could be work related. Yeah, you're working hard towards it. It's gonna take some because you're extremely confident. So it may be hard to like relinquish that control as well. Just as far as you know, it's for some, you know, you could have been alone for a while and. Here it is, something balanced. Career-wise, there's a hell of an idea coming. You may have to fight for it a little bit, but if you've been really working towards your career, that's going to bring some balance, especially if it's been a little setback. Look at things from other perspectives, other angles, and that flow will come, or that idea will come. But with this person, there's all kinds of new opportunities here, but um, I'm not I, uh, see the seven of swords. So still, you don't trust it. Can't the Scorpio Pisces with the can cups. You don't trust it, and I'm not going to tell you you should, but this person is trying to return. This person betrayed you in the past, but they're also your wish fulfillment. There's new beginnings here with the seven of swords popping out. Yeah, see, that's your energy, the Queen of uh, Pentacles. Sorry, I keep talking over myself. Um, there could be some spying, some checking in, but we do have the Seven of Swords still here. So this was third party in the past, so they did something. Somebody's energy was pulled. It wasn't even. Just be mindful because there is love here and a new cycle beginning, so it's like new season starting. But just, just be mindful, okay? You already are, though. You're already very... <laughs> on alert it looks like all right cat hope this helps hope this resonated for you if so please make sure that you like and subscribe below <clears throat> if you guys like to contact me for a personal reading you can find that information below as well you guys take care and i will see you next time bye